welcome to Karen's Smoothie Bar today. So I'm going to make the most popular smoothie that we have at Karen's Fresh Corner here in Chicago. And it's so simple, it's so easy, and there's so many variations, not to mention it's so healthy for you. So we've done other YouTubes, look it up, on how to make almond milk easy. So we have a bottle of almond milk here, ice cubes, some dates, frozen bananas. You know what the most commonly asked question is? How do you peel a frozen banana? Well, you peel it before you freeze it, okay? So I'm going to use my blender for this. Um, very simple and easy. So I'm just going to take my frozen bananas, plop them in. I'm going to take some of my milk, probably about 12 to 14 ounces, depending on how much of the drink. I like to make my milk kind of thick. Okay, we're going to put our milk in. These are four dates that I have soaking. I always have a jar of soaking dates in my refrigerator. I don't know when I'm going to need to make a quick dessert or whatever, so I always have my dates soaking, and you can always use the water for syrup afterwards. You could just blend the dates and make a date syrup. Vanilla, my favorite. I'm going to add a little vanilla to it. And ice. Make it nice and cold and creamy. All right, and... Uh, this is the really rare and raw smoothie. And what makes it really rare is because we're using the nut milk and we're using bananas and 100% raw, no apple juice or anything. Although you could do the same thing and add a little apple juice if you wanted to it. Okay, let's turn this on and see what we got. And I just made Karen's really rare and raw smoothie. Now this is for all the folks that come in here day after day looking for the smoothie. Now you can make it at home, so simple, so easy. But what I do when I order the smoothie, and let's pour it in the glass and get this ready. What I do in the restaurant when I order the smoothie for myself is I add a supplement to it because it's so delicious by itself. But it's a great way to get them. Let's throw in this last bit of ice. It's a great way to get in supplements. So you could add maca powder to it for your immune system. If you don't have dates on hand, you could use a little agave or maple syrup. One of the things I love to do is add spirulina to mine and make it green. So the spirulina is a form of algae, a single cell perfect food for human beings, one of the first foods on the planet. Plus you're getting green. Um, I think I've said in some of my other uh, YouTubes or in, and classes that we're supposed to be taking in about 60-70% chlorophyll a day. So this is a great way to get your chlorophyll in if you're not going to be drinking lots of wheatgrass all day, and they all have slightly different cellular structures anyway. So now I just added a supplement to my really rare and raw. Let's try this for you real quick. Oh, is that delicious? Mmm. It's wonderful. Okay, now we've added a supplement to it. And now it's the same thing green, all right? And you could just go on and on and on with this basic recipe. Let's put this in here. Look how pretty that is. And then, I don't know, I have to do this again at Christmas time. You know what we could do if it were Christmas time? We could take some goji berries, or you could put cacao nibs, or you could, ooh, you know what you could do instead of the spirulina? You could add pumpkin spice to it at Halloween. That's what we should have done today. Okay, so we can add some goji berries on top. This one, the plain one, we'll add some cacao nibs on top. Okay. And, um, gee. I don't know, I just made two really delicious fast drinks there, and you could just go on and on and on with it. If you got any ideas, send them to me. I would love to hear from you. Um, oh, and if anybody's wondering about this t-shirt, this is an original Dr. Ann Wigmore. This was from her Hippocrates Institute in Boston, the very first raw food place in the United States. And she actually got sued by Coca-Cola for infringement rights for saying it's the real thing. So this is a very rare t-shirt I'm very honored to have because they didn't confiscate mine when they were grabbing them all up. So anyway, here's to your health. Hope to see you again soon. Please, please, please subscribe to my YouTube station. Um, Want to keep sharing stuff with you. Love to hear from you. Here's to your health. I'm going to do a green one first. I don't even taste this for a little.